Hey guys, Xquad KC here, and today I'm back with a new series. I don't know why I always say I'm back when I'm starting a new series, but whatever. I'm back in Pokemon with Pokemon White 2. Um, it is the sequel to Pokemon White, which we didn't quite finish. <laughs> we finished in a non completative way. Let's just put it that way. Um, I'm sure what we missed in failing the Nuzlocke won't be at all important or relevant to this game, right? Being a sequel and all. It's fine. Alright, let's uh, skip all the intro nonsense and get straight into it then, shall we? We shall start a new game. It's been a while, hasn't it? Hi there! Welcome to the world of Pokemon! My name is Perfect. I need to pick a, a good voice. My name... no. My... My name's Professor Juniper. Everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Nah, that ain't right. We'll get there. We'll get there. We'll get a good... good voice going. That's right! This world... <laughs> I keep going into weird voices. Um, let's think. She's American. But not deep voice American. Okay. Uh, that's right, this world is widely inhabited by mysterious creatures called Pokemon. Pokemon have mysterious powers. They come in many shapes and live in many different places. We humans live happily with Pokemon. Living and working together, we can we complement each other. We help each other out to accomplish difficult tasks. Having Pokemon battle one another is particularly popular, and it deepens the bonds between people and Pokemon. And that is why I research Pokemon. Oh no, the voice is going weird again. Well, that's enough from me. Could you tell me about yourself? No. Um, am I a boy or a girl? I think I'll stick with boy. That's some crazy hair. Yeah, I'm a boy. You would like to know my name. How many letters do we have to work with? Ooh, not many. Um, hmm, do we go for a classic, just a, a KC? What symbols do we have to work with? Okay, see? Ah. Sure, that works. No, wait. Sure, I don't know. That way I have to make an annoying sound every time I say my name. Your name is KC? Ah. Yes. So your name's KC? Ah. What a wonderful name. Could you tell me a little about your friend, the older boy who lives nearby? Would you mind telling me his name? Hugh? Please. I think, I think you heard wrong. It's huge. Ackman. Sure. He's huge. Huge? Did I get that right? Yes, but it's pronounced huge. KC! Ah! I'm going to entrust you with a Pokemon. I'm sure you'll be great partners. The moment you choose the Pokemon, will I will accompany you on you that, that will accompany on your, your your journey. The story will truly begin. Blah, 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 blah. During your journey, you will meet many Pokemon and people with different personalities and points of view. I really hope you learn what is important to you as a result of your travels. That's right. Befriend new Pokemon and people and grow as a person. That's the most important goal of your journey. Is it though? Let's go visit the world of Pokemon! Autumn. Oh, a cinematic cutscene. Oh boy. Those mountains don't look flat at all. Whoa, there's wind blowing, and leaves, and all sorts of 3D things. It's just like magic. Meanwhile, there's probably a big black void just slightly to the left. Ah, yes. Is it gonna blow in the window? No? Yes? No? What's going on? People can't look around in Pokemon games. What? Oh, hi! 
Why, Aurea Juniper? It's been far too long. What can I do for you? Wow, a Pokedex for my child? Why, that's great. I think a journey would be a wonderful experience. What now? She's already here. Oh, for Pete's sake, you never change. Once you've decided on something, you just start going. Okay, Bian Bianca, right? A big green hat. Got it. Okay, no worries. Sure. Alright. I'm guessing that's mum. Or mom. I'm not sure. KC! Ah, I'm home! Uh, okay. Damn it, it's empty. Is that a Wii console? Do you know Professor Juniper? She's a famous Pokemon researcher. Yeah, she was just talking to me. She asked me my name. And she asked me Yuja's name as well. Actually, she's an old friend of mine. And she called me today for the first time in ages. This is out of the blue, but KC... Ah! Do you want to have a Pokemon? Yes. Okay, step one completed. Well then, do you know what a Pokedex is? Yes. I knew you would. Isn't it amazing how it automatically records Pokemon you encounter? Why are you telling me this? I already know that. Yet another question. You want a Pokedex, right? Nah. I don't mean to be selfish, but I'd like it if you're a bit more agreeable. Having a Pokedex means traveling around the world. Think about that for a second. So I'll ask you again. You want a Pokedex, right? Fine. Okay, step two completed. KC, ah! Your course of action has been set. A girl named Bianca has come here to meet you. She's Professor Juniper's assistant. I was told to simply look for a big green hat. That's right, you're going to look for Bianca. And then you'll get a Pokedex and a Pokemon to be your partner. Oh, your x transceiver's in your bag, right? Do you know how to open your bag? Yes. Maybe. The girl's name is Bianca. I was told you should look for a big green hat. She might be lost because it's her first time here. Go look for her. Okay, yes. But first... Is this a Wii console? It's a Wii console! It has a Wii remote! Oh boy! Trash can's empty. Okay, fine. What the hell? It's a model of a Ferris wheel. Mom bought as a souvenir. Okay. Okay, we're probably gonna get barged into. Hi, KC! Ah! Look, you found huge. Hey! You get a Pokemon yet? There aren't any Pokemon trainers around here, and I'm getting bored. What's that? A person named Bianca is giving you a Pokemon. Really? KC! Ah! If you get a Pokemon, take really, really good care of it, okay? Yeah. Okay, let's go get your Pokemon. It's something I have to do. And to do that, I need someone I can trust besides my partner Pokemon. A person I can trust. That's right, I'm talking about you. I know what accent I'm going into. You seem like you've got good instincts. You hit on home. Okay, big brother. <laughs> what was that? Bye bye, Casey. Ah! Alright, let's go find that person named Bianca. Let's go. I'm guessing not here. Where are we? Up further, I suppose. Ah, oh, not being able to run is a pain. Hmm, I'm guessing not here. Yep. That goes to Route 19. If you don't find Bianca here in town, I'll go check it for you. Because I already have a Pokemon. Okay, sure. So, must be up here then. Wherever this goes. I'm not familiar with this town. Oh, I get it. That look is Aspertia's, Aspertia's most famous spot. Bet Bianca is up there looking for the scenery. Come on, go get your Pokemon already. 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 Okay, you're South African or something now, apparently. Somewhere between South Africa and New Zealand. It's so pretty. Hey there. Don't you agree? Is she, like, red-faced? Oh, my name is Bianca. I'm the assistant of the Pokemon professor, Professor Juniper. By the way, I'm looking for someone. Do you know a person named KC? Ah! Yes. Oh wait, 
You're KC. Huh. Wow, you're exactly like what I heard. Really? Nice to meet you. Yeah, I have a really important request to ask you. Will you help us complete the Pokédex? Yes. Oh wow, thanks! Your support will help Professor Juniper's research move forward. Anyway, filling up the Pokédex is totally fine. Okay. Okay, bye, I guess. See? Bianca was here, right? Now come on, go and get your Pokémon. Oh... I gotta talk to her again? Okay then, ta-da! And here's the Pokémon that will be your partner. Oh, it's her glasses that are red, I see. Um, oh. What did we choose last time? We chose Tepig. Didn't last long. It was alright. What do you reckon the first gym is going to be? What has the most type advantages? Uh, let's think. Uh, grass is good on a few things. Are they all equal, pretty much? If I think fire is technically better on more things, right? Uh, but not the sort of things you'd find in a gym. It's good on grass, obviously. Um, water is not the sort of thing that would be good on gyms unless it's a fire one. I forget what the gyms are. I guess if there's like a ground gym? A groundy rocky gym? But then this would also be good on a groundy rocky gym. I don't know. Water and grass are very similar. Only difference is what the is whether it's good on fire, water, or grass. Um but then fire. I already did fire last time, so we'll go Go with Snivy or Snivy. Yeah. Casey ah, chose Snivy or Snivy. I have to say it every time. Oh wow, you and Snivy or Snivy are a perfect match. By the way, would you like to give a nickname to the Pokemon you chose? Yes. Hmm, okay. Okay, um, I'm gonna just call it something like, uh, let's go... Snake... Dam. Um... Snake thing, yeah, there we go. Snake Thing! Is that the nickname you want? <laughs> Snake Thing! That is such a great name! Yeah, sure. Now you've got your Pokemon, so I'll give you this too! A Pokédex! Yay! KC oh, received the Pokédex. Oh, yawn. Excuse me. <laughs> you want to know what it does? No. The Pokédex is a high-tech device that automatically records the Pokémon you encounter. Wow! Against their will? So Professor Juniper wants you to carry this Pokédex, visit a lot of places, and meet all the Pokémon in the Unova region. Or Unova. That it? Okay, cool, bye. Damn it. Hey! How long you plan on keeping me waiting anyway? Anyway, what was that voice? <laughs> hey, what's that? So that's your partner, huh? That's great! My sister already said so, but take really, really good care of your Pokemon, got it? What's that you're holding there? It's a Pokédex! Please give me a Pokédex too! I want to get stronger! If I have a Pokédex, I can learn more about Pokemon! That'll make me tougher, right? Um, who are you again? I'm huge! <laughs> I'm going to travel the universe region with my Pokemon partner in order to search for something very important. Well, okay. I don't really get it, but going on a journey is always good. Anyway, I just happen to have another Pokedex on me. 
It looks like Pokemon distribution has really changed compared to two years ago, so the more the merrier. Okay. Oh, I thought of something cool. You both have Pokemon, right? Why don't you have a Pokemon battle? No. Yes. Let's see how good a trainer you are. I'll use my Tippic that I raised from an egg. He's raised it from an egg. Damn, son. He's huge. Uh, the challenge by Pokemon trainer, huge. He's in our Tippic. Okay, let's see how we manage to somehow do against this thing. Type advantages don't matter yet, so that's always something. Tackle. My favorite move. I shall keep it till level 50. I won't forget the pain you just put my partner through. Oh dear. He's gonna stab me in my sleep. Oh no, we're both using tackle. Quick, use it, use this move. Thank you. Very useful when they use useless moves against you. Oh no, I thankfully used another useless move, again. No point lowering my defense if you're not going to attack me, mate. Oh yeah.